Morning, people. I didn't get in until late last night. Obviously, I had a late night at Scottish last night. I think I got in about two-ish or half two. Well, it might have even been quarter three. I don't really know. It was late anyway. Right, uh, I'm going to go to Partick, try to get a filter for this still forklift for Scotty, and then carry on, basically, from yesterday morning, what I was meant to do yesterday. Because <laughs> I got in the vortex, did I? There's something like force field in that yard that when you go in there, it just doesn't want you to leave. It's like it, it's like it wants your body there. Anyway, we better get on our travels, aren't we? Our working travels. Lay dag, what do you say? You had a late night last night, didn't you, lay dag? Boom, <laughs> lay dag, beautiful lay dag. It's a good, it's a good job I had you to back me up last night, lay dag. <laughs> good old lay dag. Hey guys, I've had something else, look, sent me, look. And this is really good. And I know it's going to be good as well. You know why I know it's going to be good? Because I own one already. There. I know the bus is in a bit of a mess, but it's from last night, obviously. I had a late night. Look, it's the 3000 Top Dom. Obviously, this Top Dom, I use it. If you watch my channel, they give me that. Obviously, just said do a review on it. Just give me it. They didn't give me no rules, rope. Just, to, just see what you think of it, Chris. And I use that daily. I charge it. Although it needs charging now because I was on the charging struggle last night. Uh, I use that all the time. You know, that, like that bike, for instance, like this top dom. I use that daily, basically. And I don't use it to promote them. I use it because it's a handy bit of kit. Same as that bike. Obviously, I can only do a review on it like, like a week half or whatever. But the the long haul of a review, if you follow my channel, is if, I, if, if I'm still using that bike in six months' time, it's a good bit of kit, isn't it? So uh, that's how you review a thing, I think, anyway. You can't just review it on, well, you know, fucking day and say, oh, yes, it's a crusty bit of kit. But I know for a fact that these are perfect. Now, this top dog, they don't do a 24-volt jumper. This is the highest one to do. Obviously, this is higher ampage than that one there. Oh, I got it out of the pack. It's, it's a good bit of kit. Look at this. Look at that. Proper chunky and all. Got a handle on it, lot. Got the same thing, charging points. Fast charge there, USB on the other side, USB. Uh, what we got? There's the jumpers. Obviously, the jumping leads and all are thicker because it's more ampage. So they're chunkier than the other one. Oh, bloody good show. I'm wondering, you know, hit me in the comments, guys, if you know. You know, I've got two of these top DOMs. And say if you're on a 24 volt system, can I put one on each battery and it'll jump like 24? Or will it like blow up them or blow up the battery i don't really know how it'll work because you can charge a 12 volt battery on a charger just on a 24 volt system just by connecting up to a 12 volt obviously just by connecting up to one battery so i wonder if you could jump it or whether it'll it might blow them up might it lily talking to my camera <laughs> I didn't really I fucking I didn't I've recognize that. What? The van? Yeah, I haven't seen you for fucking years, have I? No, no, no. How are you? Alright, dude, alright. Look, got this given me, Bobby. What's that? It's a jump pack. You don't know what these are? You don't know what these are, guys. Mechanic and all. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Lee. I You're not camera shy, yeah? Oh, Lies in Lee Chapman, look. <laughs> That's Lee, look there. <laughs> Oh, How are we doing, Lily? Oh, mate. Oh. Watch, these are the bollocks. You need to get one of them if you haven't got one. Top dog. I use that all the time, that top dog. Jumpers, they are. Charging my phone up and all that. Lot. Bloody good. I can do one for getting me going in the morning. <laughs> we all need that one. I'll just say that this morning. Look, if you need any hydraulic pipes, do it. Look, ring that number up. <laughs> He'll come out to you straight away, isn't it, Lee? Straight away, you'll come out. And if he comes out straight away, he'll charge you for the year he's been waiting for that one phone call as well, isn't it, Lee? Yes, one phone. Lily. It's a bit done. That's well, Dad. He's not my Dad, but we'll call him Dad. Again, good party. Can always do talk all the time. <laughs> I've got that filter. Look how big it is, love. That's the only one that screws onto it. Got you on film, Dad. <laughs> It would be rude not to go to the Golden Arches, wouldn't it? It's a nice 
after. Hello. He was here at seven this morning. Two minutes past seven, lot. What time did we get done? Two o'clock. Half two we got home. Here we're going at seven. Yeah. Here now, Robert, lot. Back to it, Rob. You won't buy fucking blades. Did you have a good night's sleep last night? Oh yeah. How's it running? Alright. Yeah. Look, Rob's got another issue here. Look, it's, what's this? A plat? Uh, what do you call it? Blade. Blade. That's far off. So I'm going to have to try my smart little stick welder on this, aren't I? Pigeon poo it up. William Wallace, everyone! Yes, sir. I'm prettier than this man. Yeah, yeah. What, William? Yeah. Have you got your welder in there? I have. Yeah, I'm going to do that. Know what you mean? Yeah. I'm gonna do it, Will. Well, was you at two o'clock this morning, Will? All right. In bed. Yeah. In bed was you? Yeah. Yeah. Hey, Rob, what was we, Rob? No, no, I've done them shit. Well, fucking don't talk like you're an old person that you've been there and done it yeah. all. Uh, hey, about three year old, I've done this all, has it? Come on. I'll tell you, mate. William Wallace. Trying to teach us how to suck eggs here, yeah. yeah, Rob. Thinks he's done everything, don't I? He's seen nothing, Rob, has he? <laughs> I may be prettier than William Wallace, but I'm not prettier than Ladak. Look at that, he's a beauty. Look how handsome he is. I couldn't think of a more handsome dog, you know. He's a bit malty at the minute, aren't you, Ladak? Getting your summer coat on, aren't you, Ladak? Look at that, that's a picture, that. Good boy. Question is, will this... Oh, it's not even going to fit in, is it? Oh, my God. Pete's sake, people. Well, it'll just have to go pissed up, won't it? I know what I can do. Bend that bit of steel, that way lot, and then it'll tilt, tilt like that lot. Perfect. You know that big change? We, we lift the uh, drums, aren't we? Yeah. I dragged them out the shredder this morning. How did they get the fucking shredder? Fuck that. Into one of my own. Just put my phone on charge with my new top dog JS3000. No biggie, guys, no biggie. I had to go to plan B on that one. Uh, I took the bracket off there and I bolted it to there, the, the, the bottle thing, and moved it all because my parts wouldn't fit and it was rubbing down there and it was no good. And now it's a lot better. Now I just need to bleed it. And it's a bigger filter now, so it's much better. Yes, but Chris, it's not the correct filter. I know, but still, it's a filter. And that's all we want, guys. We, we've got diesel coming out. I better check the water, aren't I, as well? Because I bet nobody has done. I had a bad connection on the wires under there. I couldn't understand why it kept on beeping, the seatbelt beep, when I lifted it up. I thought, what's he got, a seat sensor so he knows it's up? But it's not, it's a loose plug. Right, this is done now. Now, on to the next job. Let's move this out of the way. Oh. What a struggle. Obviously, my pigeon poo alone isn't going to hold that, is it? I don't think, anyway. I wouldn't have thought so. I don't put much faith in my own pigeon, anyway. Right, let's clean up goat welding first. What? Well, did you do gun cut this morning? We could have done with that last night, Robert, couldn't we? Bloody hell. I was just going to restuff my dog stand, but look at it now. There's not a lot left of it, is there? It'll live to fight another day. <laughs> Better seeds with my little stick. I need some thicker rods, they're too thin, then rods off. I'm nearly out of rods, so uh, I've just got to weld some plates here. It'll have to do, won't it? It'll no doubt fall off soon. I can't find no plates, but I can find long bolts. So he wants one there and he wants one down there because you see his tines keep falling out the middles of them. 
and I've got five sticks left. I'll just have to do the top ones and see how I go on when I'm. I even managed to do all four on my limited amount of welding rods to go with my limitless stuff. Revenue, thank you. Right, let's go before we get sucked into the vortex. While everything's going right, he's using that now. So let's go before it breaks. <laughs> Isn't it? I've got to go to fit some wings to a wagon, uh, which I was meant to do yesterday, but obviously I didn't get around to doing it. So let's go there now. That was Daryl on the other side of the carriage, right? Fixing that line. Looks like he's putting some coolant in it. He's another lad that works out his van mobile on the old spanner struggle. I was just thinking, coming back down here, I'm thinking. There's loads of cars broke down at side road with blowouts and, and lorries with blowouts and like that overheating. It's just a bit of a heat, isn't it? We just can't we just can't stand the heat in our country, can we? Everything just falls apart, doesn't it? <laughs> bit of heat and we're all struggling, aren't we? Right, I fuel, I'm dipping in this garage for a bit of a dippy doppy of the fuely hooly. There's a lady laid out here on the garage floor here, looks like, well, the bloke said she's like fainted and bang, banged red. She's conscious, like you, you can see him pouring a cloth over her face and that. Uh, the bloke said they've been waiting an hour for the ambulance to come. Uh, and there's a, there's a couple there and all, and, and the woman at the thingy says, uh, the, uh, the lady in pink, one of the ladies that was there, uh, was a doctor anyway, so she, 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 she's been with her the whole time, for the, the, for the whole hour. There is some nice people, you see, mate. See, we're just in a rush too much, aren't we? Just come on, I'll get up, man. You're dragging it out now. We need to, I need to get fueled up. <laughs> Isn't it? Fucking hell, I've got work to do here. <laughs> Lay down in the middle of the fucking floor. <laughs> I'm only joking, guys. See, Malcolm. See, Malcolm, see, Malcolm. Slip road lot, snarled up lot, every time people. Bloody saw the slip road out, somebody please. This is just an accident, obviously. You don't want to be queuing up on a door carriageway. And this ain't just once in a while, this is all the time, people. Look, this is where the problem lies, look. People are queuing up for the A17 on that road there, A17 that is. The need to make it two carriageways there for the A17 turn off because all these going around to the A17 turning right, they've only got one carriageway. That's why everyone gets snarled up. Look, turning left, free, free as a bird. Look, turning right, queuing they are. So it's queuing right the way back onto the A1. So make fucking two lanes there. Look, cure, don't you? Problem solved. Come on, people. The struggle is road review. Bloody hell. Nice, Joe, nice. Hey! <laughs> Do you remember this man on my channel? Joe Bilton, everyone. Yeah, well. Are you cleaning down for the week? Oh, nice to see you, Chris. Nice to see you, Joe. Got a bit of great hair, mate. Yes. Look at this, a bit of fifth wheel grease, people. Look at that. We don't care. Fucking like it, it's good lubrication. <laughs> look at that, look. that's changed, hasn't it? Can you remember last time we've seen this? That's come on, hasn't it? Ready. Some bloke had a breakdown last night. I was working till two o'clock. Ding ding, I'm till quarter three and in the morning. Bloody hell, it looks smart though, doesn't it, Joe? Hopefully. Now, the big question is she going to start or is she not? Well, when's the last time you started her? I've been saving it for you. I've been saving the situation for you. What's some batteries over the span? Well, are they a bit dodgy? <laughs> There's other like a good and oh oh revs a bit, revs a bit. Side pass. Yeah, beautiful. Yeah, you 
can't just go revving the bollocks off there, can you? She's sort of sweeping the nut, Joe, yeah, wouldn't she? Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, you've done a good job of that, lot. That's kept her going for a bit, Joe, hasn't it? Like that. Let's have a look at the inside. I'm going to go around to clean it yet, but. Uh, oh, Joe, she's a beast! The roof's got a bit of a leak in, but I can get rid of them stains. What, there? Yeah, it's, we've got to fill them things. Yeah, the thatch curtains for it. Just have got you? Just got a hole in it, that's there, look. Ah, character that, isn't it? Eat. Eating, look. I says to Joe, you ain't got no dogs here, Joe, have you? Because obviously Lear Dog will ravage them. We're all right. It's oh, bloody good, that is, isn't it? What's that off? It's off an MAN. <laughs> is it? I tell you what, though, it looks good, though, Joe, doesn't it? It sits right. It sits fine, with you. You wouldn't know it wasn't made for the job, would you? That's what he wants me to do. Fit some wings to that, Joe, innit? Yeah, please. I'll do it. Because Joe said every time he does it, it looks a bit gashy, didn't Joe? Yeah, no, I, cu I cut twice and measured it. <laughs> <laughs> he got some clamps and br uh, bridge. Oh, look, he's got all the gear here. Look, he even sprayed it. Wait, look. I'll go and get you more. Are they the ones? No, no, no. Bro. Oh, you got brand spankers up, Lord. Did no expense spared, Joe. Look, he's got some treasure troves around here, Joe, as if you hadn't seen my video before when we went around here. Got some lovely little beauties here, he has. Bit overgrown then. Bit overgrown. We're going to spray it tonight when everybody's gone home. The hobby that turns to an addiction. Hey Joe. You have done well in two months, Joe. Fracking, you've turned it round, ain't you? To say you only do it part time, ain't you? Mm, that's that early. Yeah, Ooh, let me listen. I'll go under. Yeah, it's gone off then, it went. There, it's off. Ah, so it's in your low then. Yeah, leaking again. Yeah, it's leaking out these two little holes there. But obviously, them holes are meant to be there. So I'm wondering, just take that pipe off and put some air gun oil down it. There might be something that's just sticking in there a bit or an O-ring on or something like that. We can try it, can't we? Just take that little pipe off and get some lubrication. Thing is, it's been stood a long time, hasn't it? So he's going to get a few teething problems, isn't he? Just try putting the iron low, see whether it'll... And there must be a seal or something, there's an O-ring in there, I thought. Yeah, yeah try to, yeah, that's it, once you go it running a bit. And if not, you might need to just strip it down for a seal in there, Joe. Mm. Tim, the sign writing lad, has done this, like, he's even done his stickers for him there, look. Tim's done a good job there, hasn't he? Tim's who did my stickers. Well, I did that front one there, but obviously he did the rest of them on the sides and that. And I made them CCM. And then I put them chevrons on because he told me not to because they'd fall off and he was right to do. <laughs> Lord, he's even got white sides. Um, oh, um, many of them have been put on the wrong side. Fucking perlocks. What's that, perlocks? Yeah, we don't fuck about. Oh, we don't have no cheap now, shit perlocks, mate. Cheap around here. How many drill holes do you want in there? Do you want loads of drill holes everywhere? Do your best. <laughs> I tell you what's good for these, you know. Roy taught me this. Oh, Roy says, I'm there with these wings, pissing round with blocks of wood and that, trying to get them level. He says, I tell you what you need there, boy. You know one of them old scissor jacks what you used to get with cars? Put all them under it and you can adjust it up and down wherever you like, lovely. And uh, and I've, I've always done it, since he told me that, I've always done it like that. But of course, I ran over my bloody scissor jack, Anna. So I'm back to the struggle again. I'll have to use this, won't I? Joe was just saying, he spent over hundred pounds just on nuts and bolts and washers and that, which you can, can't you? Thing is, I said to Joe, you can soon lose some money. You know, if you don't charge them out and then you have to replenish all your stock lot, that's hundred quid out, gone out, your fucking profits, isn't it? Because I never put on nuts and bolts, you know, and I go through no end of fucking nuts and bolts. That's why people always put down consumable items, don't they? And I never do, because I'm a soft arse, isn't it? Fucking charity event. Bloody good show, Chris.
one. You know, if the two straight, as, as, yeah. <laughs> as Joe just said, if the two straight, then we'd just one go, wouldn't it? Yeah, you'd, 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 you'd go on sideways, rip the mug guards off, take a bit to workshop, and then come out like that. That's wouldn't it, they? all buckle. Get on with it, you got my. With LV boards riveted to the inside of it. <laughs> but that's as far in as they'll go, look at the back, look, Maybe Joe. That's just because it's, it's up against your spring, if not. Yeah, I've got some lovely scammel moss flaps to go on the back of them. Oh, have you got them? Yeah, I ain't got them here. Oh, they're, pity. They're still on print. Oh, they're still on print. That one, I've just got to reposition that one. It's just slanting down a bit in that corner because his wing stays a bit bent, but... Never mind. Look at this, well, this is old school. Look at this. Oh, this is what we used to do back in the day, people. <laughs> and, uh, this is what we used to do, lot. Get your old tip fell out, Joe, isn't it? <laughs> People guess what that was behind there. Did they? Yeah, what is it? Scammel. Yeah, scammel. Yeah, that's what most people said, scammel. Mm. Sc what, why is that undercover then, Joe? Because uh, the paint's going pink. Oh, the is it? Sun's getting, sun's on, sun's it. going see, on it. See, that's going pink. Yeah, yeah, it is. Ah. And I've got to get that covered off. But you, as many times as you polish it, get another a week or so. A dull again. Pink. Yeah, it's a... The pigment in the paint. Yeah, it? it's it's gone it through, hasn't it? Paint, but it? It was what we had in the day. Well, yeah, this <laughs> is it. Yeah, it's whatever you had, isn't it? <laughs> is that another one then for the restoration, or is that done then? That oh, one? that's done. I'm just waiting on bits. Oh yeah. I'm just waiting on some bits. We've got the accelerator pedal and the brake pedal because they're done rotten dirt. Oh yeah. I'm just waiting for a pump head. Oh, I've just put the cherry on the cake there, Joe, didn't I? Oh, I just come and took all your glory. All the glory. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> now you'll take the glory when you put the scandal flaps at the back. <laughs> Yeah, give us a ring. Joe, Joe's going to ring me when he gets this beast on the road. Uh, we get a road test. Give it a road. When he gives it a road test. Yeah. Well, I'm a bit of recording. I'm hoping the limiter's broken. <laughs> and if not, it might, it might have to break, might it? What's <laughs> <laughs> it calibrating? <laughs> oh, yes, it's got to be calibrated. Of course it has, Joe. Oh, that's illegal. Oh, yes, we don't do anything like that. Joe is officially a professional struggler now. Hey, Joe, yay! <laughs> Catch you on the next one, guys!